Cheryl, tonight that passenger says the entire plane full of United passengers is grateful to be on the ground safely in Washington, D.C. tonight after their first flight leaving O'Hare this afternoon was rocked by severe weather. This is the sign of a flight gone wrong. From the aisle of the plane, an exiting passenger snapped this picture of a nearly shattered windshield. I was thinking to myself, how did that happen? United Flight 349 took off from O'Hare mid-afternoon, and a flight tracker shows as it got out over Lake Michigan headed east, the plane abruptly turned around. When we hit probably the 15 miles in height, there was a pitch down that changed, and it was more of a bit of a climb. There was no bump. There was no, you know, shift of movement. Back on the tarmac at O'Hare with little warning, fire trucks came rushing to the plane in case of any need for evacuation. That was when I realized we got lucky. We, it happened right over Lake Michigan. So everybody was fortunate. We're here walking on the ground instead of being in the water. United says it was hail from afternoon storms that pelted the plane's windshield. But the passengers who rode out the weather storm, mostly oblivious to the danger, say it was a talented pilot who maneuvered them safely back to solid ground. I'll be really happy. I'll be really happy to go back to work tomorrow. It's been like, okay, things are back to normal. I made it. United was able to get those passengers onto a new plane and headed to Washington, D.C. after just a short delay. And that passenger we spoke to said she was amazed to see it was the very same pilot who was completing that second flight. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.